The crown of Princess Blanche, also known as the crown of Palatine or the Bohemian crown, is the oldest royal crown in England. Just imagine, it is dated around 1370, and the first record of it appeared in 1399. Both the height and the diameter of the golden crown are 18 centimeters or 7.1 inches. It consists of a hoop, which is crowned with 12 teeth in the form of fleur-de-lis. The teeth alternate in height and can be dismantled, while the base of the crown can be folded. All this is done for convenient storage and transportation of jewelry. In the center of the fleur-de-lis, sapphires and rubies alternate. And in some sources they even write that these are bale rubies, that is, spinel. There is number 100% information, but it will not be at all surprising if spinel really turns out to be in the crown. Until a certain time, such errors occurred quite often. The hoop itself is a composition of 12 hexagons, decorated with jewelry enamel and precious stones. A blue sapphire shines at the center of each link, 11 of which are cut in the shape of ovals and one in the shape of a hexagon. In addition to sapphires and rubies, the crown is also adorned with four pearls arranged in flower arrangements. The center of each flower is encrusted with an emerald or diamond. The first mention of the crown appeared in 1399 in a list of jewels that belonged to the already deposed King of England, Richard II. It was indicated that the jewelry weighs just under a kilogram and is valued at 246 pounds. At that time, the crown was encrusted with 91 pearls, 63 rubies, 47 sapphires, 33 diamonds and 5 emeralds, and one of the prongs was completely missing. It is believed that the first owner of the crown was Anna of Bohemia, the wife of Richard II. From this fact put forward three versions of the origin of the crown. According to the first, the crown was made in Bohemia and ended up in England as part of Anna's dowry. However, the manner in which the elements are executed points to Paris. The crown could equally well have been made in France as in Bohemia by a jeweler of French origin. The third possible place for the manufacture of the crown is called Venice. In 1399, Henry IV took over from Richard II. To consolidate his position, he sought to forge alliances with European rulers. At the same time, King Ruprecht III of Germany was looking for allies. The rulers agreed in aspirations and decided to marry Ruprecht's eldest son, Ludwig, to Henry's eldest daughter, Blanche. As a dowry, Blanche included not only 40,000 gold coins, but also the same crown. Before the wedding, the crown was even given to a London jeweller for restoration he added a twelfth prong and replaced the missing stones. On July 6, 1402, Blanche wore the crown to her wedding, and a few years after her death, someone pawned the crown at the monastery of Malbron in 1421. By that time, several gems and pearls had already been extracted from the crown. They probably sold them too. Today, the crown is displayed in the treasury of the Munich residence, where it has been kept since 1782. And in 1988, she returned to England for the first time as part of the exhibition The Age of Chivalry at the Royal Academy of Arts in London. Before that, the last time she was seen in Blanche's homeland was in 1401.